All right, you guys, so I'm going to show you today how to take a hat like this and turn it into a hat like this. Keep watching. Starting off, you're going to use a knife to open your parcel. Also, you will need a black fitted cap, a mug with a large circumference, a dish to hold your crystals, and an eye pencil and sharpener. I'm using two types of Swarovski crystals, Crystal AB SS10 and S8 flatback. Then you want to take your mug, place it in the center of your cap and draw a circle. Once you have your circle on your hat, go ahead and pull up the hat logo for reference. I'm an artist so I have no problem drawing it freehand, but if trying is not your strong suit, then feel free to use a ruler to help you out. If you make any mistakes, then go ahead and use some micellar water to clean it up. In case you guys are wondering, I'm using the brand's KB Ethos for my hat. Another suggestion I have is to keep the cardboard in the hat whilst you are working as it will give the hat more stabilization. For the next step, I am using the Doris Hot Fix Applicator Wand to apply crystals with hot fix glue on the backs. Then taking an eye pencil or brow pencil as they tend to be a bit more waxy, Pick up a crystal, place it on the outline, and use the wand to set it in place. If you want to ensure that the glue is melted, use the side of the heated wand to set it in place. Go ahead and repeat this until you've made an outline for the circle with crystals.
Once you have completed your outline of crystals, I'm going to show you the ways to adhere flat back crystals. The first is using Gorilla Glue. Whilst the crystals will adhere, I do not advise this method as the glue tends to expand and turn out. However, if you are in a pinch with a spatula, spread a very thin layer onto the hat, then use your pencil to place the crystals in a row. When arranging the rows, place them in an even and hard formation. In doing so, you will eliminate gaps between the crystals. The second option and my preferred method is using E6000 glue. This glue has a much thicker and tackier consistency but it dries clear. Again, with the spatula, apply a thin layer onto the hat and work in small sections. Once you fill in the hatch with crystals, now is your opportunity to go back and even out any spaces that you may have missed previously. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed filming it for you. And make sure to check out the makeup look for Cosmic Mario. Be sure to like this video if you have not already. And I'm on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. That all is Alejandro the King. And as always, you guys, I'll see you next time. Be soon as I mean.